Hi, my name is Devon. Um, I went to Southwest Community College 2012, and this is my crazy dating story. <clears throat> so, I met Marissa back when I was um, working part-time at the Malco Movie Theater. Um, she used to basically be a regular. She'd come in almost every week, even if she was to see the same movie over again. I don't know why. So one day, I finally approached her, and I just finally said something to her, because um, I always used to notice her when she comes in, but I just never said anything. Back then, I was pretty shy. I build my self-confidence up right about now, but back then, I was really shy, and it took a lot for me to say something to her. So I finally said something to her, and we, over the time, we got to know each other after she gave me her number. And we were together for about two years. Everything was going good, um, from dating, just hanging out, spending time with each other. Um, but during the time of dating, um, I would never come around her family. She, she met a couple of my family members, but I just wouldn't come around hers because she said that hers was overprotective over her and she just didn't want her family to not accept me because that would pretty, pretty much crush her. Um, but during the time that we were dating, we also agreed that we wouldn't have sex or anything of that nature until marriage. All right, so um, one day we finally decided to, I wouldn't say break the um, rule of sex before marriage, but it was to the point to where we were both ready, and we knew that we both were meant for each other. So we just went on and did it. I mean, we just went on and decided to go for it, <laughs> basically. Um, at the time, I was still staying with my parents. She was staying with her parents, so I just used my little check money from the movie theater, rented us a hotel room for the night, and from there, it was some foreplay going on. Clothes started coming off. Um, and she just told me before um, I took her pants off that it was something that she had to tell me and I wouldn't listen, that I was, I was just so ready because it's been almost two years and we, we haven't did anything, so I'm like, I'm ready, I'm pumped. Come to find out that Marissa, real name is Michael. She had a penis, and <laughs> mm, mm, mm. <sighs> it just messed up my whole the whole night basically. Um, I didn't know words can't even explain how I felt at that moment. Two years, man. Two. I fucking loved you. Am I crying? Is my eyes watering up? <laughs> oh man! From at, at that moment, I didn't I didn't know what to say. I just I just felt so I don't know. I just felt like I was lied to. I couldn't trust anyone. It's it just it was just so much that to take in at one time. That the woman that I thought I loved is really a guy, and I don't know. Like I couldn't do it. That's not me. So I just had to leave. I left her there at the hotel and blocked her. I, I had no more contact with her at all. It got to the point to where she would come, still come up to the job. I had to leave the job. I put my notice in and found another job. No contact was kept at all. Like I said, she tried, but it was, it was that. I just couldn't do it. And that is my crazy dating story. Uh. <laughs>